So this patient was a pre-diabetic. And this is very important. This is what caught my attention. Because when I looked at my patients that were coming in with heart attacks and hardening of the arteries, and when I tried to identify why they're doing this, None of them were diabetics, but then I did a glucose tolerance test on them. And what happened, it was just by chance that I happened to have these tests in my office where you can measure the blood glucose. So I had about 120 of them, and I found that at least half of them had no diabetes, but their glucose intolerance. That means that the sugars went up, but not enough to make them a diabetic, but it did go above the normal range. We did not have insulin testing at that time. About 10 years later, we started testing insulin in the office, and I bought a machine for this purpose in my office to measure insulin levels and life was never the same again. Why? Because it's all about insulin when it comes to the metabolic derangement. So I found that these patients, the sugars were going up to 50, 60 after giving them a glucose drink. Mm -hmm. So you say, okay, he's not a diabetic. Look, the sugar didn't really go high. But when you measured the insulin level, the insulin was off the roof.